The University of Georgia has dismissed baseball player Adam Sasser after he allegedly shouted racial epithets at Bulldogs quarterback Justin Fields during the fourth quarter of the football team's win over Tennessee on Saturday. Athletic director Greg McGarity announced the decision in a statement on Wednesday, two days after a pair of students reportedly claimed to hear the senior first baseman yell racial slurs, including the N-word, at Fields. The incident continued into Monday, according to McGarity, when another student reported those comments on a Bulldogs fan Facebook page. While we are limited in what we can say about the incident at this time, I want to emphasize that we do not condone discriminatory behavior, McGarity said. The university's Equal Opportunity Office thoroughly reviews all reported violations of our non-discrimination and anti-harassment policy to ensure an appropriate response. Baseball coach Scott Strickland was also involved in the decision to dismiss Sasser. I expect every member of our team to behave at all times in a way that upholds the highest standards and values of the University of Georgia, and it is disappointing when that doesn't happen, Strickland said in a statement released Monday. While I cannot comment on this matter, we cooperate fully in any investigation involving an alleged violation of university policies. Share this article Share Georgia's entire fall baseball roster, and nearly all of its coaches are white. Sasser apologized on Twitter and claims to have spoken to Fields, insisting the two are now on good terms. First and foremost, I want to apologize for my actions at the football game on Saturday, he wrote. I totally understand why my actions were offensive, and I am deeply sorry for any pain or distress this has caused anyone. Secondly, I would like to apologize to the University of Georgia, my teammates and my coaches for the past three plus years and say that I am extremely sorry I have put you all in this position and wish nothing but the best for everyone. Lastly, I would like to thank my parents, extended family and too many friends to count for the love and constant support my whole life, but especially during these past few days. I deeply regret disappointing each of you and will do everything in my power to never disappoint any of you again. Junior Africa Bugs, who was one of the students that notified the school of Sasser's behavior, was surprised by the outcome. I did not expect this outcome, but I'm happy something was done, Bugs told the Atlanta Journal-Constitution. I just hope this serves as a warning to other people that your actions have consequences, no matter who you are. Bugs insists she did not want to ruin somebody's life, but did not want to see Sasser laugh it off. I know there are others on campus, not just Adam Sasser, who think that what he did was okay, she said. To those people I say, think again. Clarissa Goulibian, who reported the incident on Facebook, was shocked to learn that Sasser was dismissed. I wasn't sure what was going to come from this, she told the HAC. At the least I expected a suspension, but I am glad that there was some action taken. A 6FT4, 225-pound senior, Sasser hit 317 with 10 home runs and 44 RBI in 59 games last season, and even tied a school record with three home runs in a single game as the Bulldogs reached the NCAA tournament for the first time in five years. Fields in the second-ranked Georgia football team will host Vanderbilt on Saturday before a highly anticipated matchup with fifth-ranked Louisiana State in Baton Rouge on October 13. On Saturday, 
Fields replaced struggling starting quarterback Jake Fromm and went on to gain 45 yards and two touchdowns on five carries. Both Sasser and Fields are Georgian natives. Sasser is a native of Greenbrier, near the South Carolina border, and Fields attended football powerhouse Harrison in Kennesaw, 